I am Sean Parks with the Aldo Leopold Wilderness Research Institute, and I'm a landscape ecologist, and I started in 2008. What got me interested in natural resource management probably uh, involves basically my upbringing as a child. I, I did a lot of camping and fishing with my family and a lot of hiking with my family. And uh, even after I left, you know, left, you know, flew the coop and went to college, I, I backpacked and hiked and fished extensively in the Sierra Nevada of California. My work is relevant to the conservation of wilderness values for several reasons, but probably the, the, most, the most important reason is that wilderness is supposed to be a place where natural processes are allowed to play out. One of those natural processes is fire. The reality is though, is that fire is suppressed, is actually suppressed in most wilderness areas and also outside of wilderness areas. And so the work that I am working on and we at the Institute are working on is basically building a case for allowing more fire to burn. Taking fire out of the wilderness and taking fire out of the ecosystem is actually a disruption itself. And that is contrary to the Wilderness Act, where these natural processes are supposed to play out. And if we can make a good case, you know, and, and provide good data to our managers, I feel that, or I hope that, they will start to manage fire in a more natural way. When fire is taken out of the wilderness, and there's a longer fire-free interval, there is an inev inevitable fire that will burn, and that inevitable fire will be more severe and, and potentially larger than, than had these previous fires not been allowed to burn. So to, to maintain wilderness character, it's essential that we allow natural processes such as fire to, to play their role.